Are you tired of applying to job after job on LinkedIn only to hear absolutely nothing? Well, what if I told you there's a hidden job market on LinkedIn that almost no one is talking about? It's a secret method that could help you find the best data jobs with way less competition and actually connect with real people like hiring managers and recruiters who can help you land an interview. In this episode, I'm going to show you the ultimate LinkedIn hack that gives you the inside track to the jobs that you actually want faster and smarter than everyone else. So buckle up, hit subscribe, and let's dive in. And just a quick side note, if you're listening to the audio podcast version of this episode, keep listening, but you also might wanna check out the YouTube video as well so you can get the step-by-step -step instructions. All right, so if you're looking for a job, you are probably doing what 99% of people do when they hop on LinkedIn to find a job. You're gonna head straight for the jobs tab, right? That's intuitive enough, that makes sense, simple. Well, here's the problem. Everyone is doing that. And within hours, those job posts have 100, 200, 500, 1,000 applicants fighting for the same role. It's basically like throwing your resume into a black hole. The odds of getting noticed, pretty slim. So if you're just scrolling through LinkedIn's regular job board, you're going to miss out on the best opportunities, the ones that you actually might land an interview from because you're competing with way too many people and by the time you apply, it's already flooded with hundreds of applicants. All right, Avery, well, that's depressing. So what should we do? Should we just get depressed and give up? Should we sit back and complain about how tough the market is and how oversaturated LinkedIn is and how we're never, ever going to stand out and never land a job? No, that's a terrible mindset. We need to just think different and act different. We need to act like the top 1% of job seekers because they are thinking differently. And more importantly, they're acting differently than the rest of us. They're really proactive and they know that they need to find jobs that are fresh, that are recently posted and have fewer applicants because then it's way easier to stand out. But most importantly, they know that it's important to make sure that they can find someone that they can network with, someone who can help them open the door and help them land an interview. This is how they're landing the best roles while all the rest of us, unfortunately, are stuck down here in the rat race for the same old job postings competing with one another. It's frustrating until today. Because here's the thing, the top 1% of job seekers aren't just scrolling through the regular job board on LinkedIn. No, they're looking at something much different than the rest of us. They're looking at a hidden job board, one that's not only difficult to access, but actually pretty tricky to navigate as well. It's a bit like a secret treasure map that not a whole lot of people know about. There's a lot of effort to actually get to the treasure, but once you get there, it's amazing. Because here's the kicker. The jobs that you find on the hidden job market are like pure gold. It's like striking oil or finding treasure in your own backyard. These roles are roles that haven't been flooded with hundreds of applicants. They're fresh, they're untouched, and best of all, they come with the opportunity to actually connect with the people behind the job posting. I'm talking recruiter, I'm talking hiring manager. So how do you and I access this hidden job market? Well, let me go ahead and show you. So open up LinkedIn and you're going to be tempted to go and click on the jobs tab, right? Because that's where the jobs are, but don't click it. Instead, go to the search bar right here, type in the phrase hiring, and then whatever role you're looking for. In this case, data analyst. Press enter. From here, once again, you're kind of on a weird in-between page on LinkedIn. You're going to be tempted to click the jobs because that's what you're looking for. Don't, instead click posts. After clicking on posts, you have to click one more thing and that is the sort by the latest show results. What this is doing is scouring all of LinkedIn, all of the posts, and looking for the phrase hiring data analyst. For any matches, we are showing the most recent here on this page. Now, there's going to be a lot on this page and I told you it's hard to navigate. It takes kind of a little bit of practice to actually figure out what jobs are of use here. But this one is a pretty good example. This was posted 10 minutes ago. It has zero likes and zero comments. It is an actual person hiring that we could reach out to. We could send them a cold direct message and send them a resume or cover letter or whatever. And we know that they're hiring as of 10 minutes ago, a research analyst. Let's scroll through and see what else we can find. This one right here looks like it's someone looking for a job. This looks like it might be outside of the country. We'd have to look at all of these links to double check. And I'm looking for more like this. DraftKings is looking for a manager platform operations analytics. This is awesome. This was 22 minutes ago. It has five likes. And this is a talent acquisition lead, which is basically a fancy way to say recruiter. So we know a recruiter 22 minutes ago didn't have enough qualified candidates for this platform operations analytics manager role. And that's why they posted it on LinkedIn. 
LinkedIn. We can look at the job description here. This is the full job description we could apply here, but also she's even inviting us to connect with you if you fit this particular role. So she's basically inviting you, begging you to reach out to her if you qualify for this role. Now, of course, there's gonna be posts like this where it is really unclear what's actually going on here. This is from some strange company and I would try to ignore these. This is one of the reasons why I said this is difficult to navigate. But here's another example from someone here in Colorado. This is a recruiter and they're looking for a database engineer. In this particular case, they even give the hourly rate, which is 70 to $75 an hour. And we could check out this person's LinkedIn page, open it up and send them some sort of a message. This was posted just 29 minutes ago. It has eight likes and only three comments. Now, if we look at these comments, you're going to see stuff like this. I'm interested, I'm interested in this position. These basically do nothing. In fact, I basically ignore all of these. This one up here is actually pretty good if they've already sent them a message or a connection request where they've actually introduced themselves, they've said what their background is, and they are inviting the actual recruiter to connect with them. Here's another one posted by a recruiter 34 minutes ago for a senior data analyst role. Once again, no likes, no comments. We could reach out to this person and talk to them. And I'm hoping that you're starting to see how powerful this is because if we go ahead and contrast this with going to the jobs tab right here, looking up data analyst in the search bar, we can see that this job was posted two weeks ago and has over a hundred applicants. So you tell me, would you like to apply for a job that's two weeks old, that has over a hundred applicants, or one that is 34 minutes old with probably zero to 10 applicants? The choice is your guys', but I'm gonna go with this hidden market way. Now, I encourage you to go try this out right now and let me know how it goes. You're going to probably figure out that it is a little bit difficult to one, get to this page, and then to two, navigate this page. It is difficult to actually see what jobs are spam, which ones are from a different country, and which ones are actually good fits for you. It doesn't have all those nice features and filters that most job boards do. It's just part of the hidden job market. So it's difficult to navigate this, and I recognize that, and so you're, Welcome to follow this hidden job market on your own. But if you'd like, I'd like to offer to navigate it for you. I created something called premiumdatajobs.com, which is exactly what it sounds like, a premium data job job board that will allow you to find the freshest, the best, and the least competitive jobs in the market everywhere online. We source these jobs from the hidden job market like I showed you today. Every day, my team scours the internet looking for these hidden job opportunities that seem like an excellent fit for people like you. Then we post it on our premium data job board. And what we'll do is when you join premiumdatajobs.com is we'll give you a survey and figure out exactly what you are looking for. And then we will do the job searching for you. It's kind of a win-win because we're already out there looking on the internet every single day for all of our clients. And then you don't have to do the boring and tedious work of finding these opportunities on this hidden job market, which is hard to navigate. So if that sounds of interest to you, go ahead and check the show notes down below or go to premiumdatajobs.com and check it out. Either way, I'm excited for you to get into these fresh data jobs and let me know if you have any questions in the comments down below.